If you're not a fan of Google's AI features, then I can show you how to disable a couple of apps that will reduce their RAM usage while gaining a little bit of performance and some added screen on time with the Pixel 9, Pixel 9 Pro, Pixel 9 Pro XL, and the Pixel 9 Pro Fold smartphones. And if you end up not being a fan of these changes, you can always go back and enable these apps again in the future as these changes are harmless and they can always be reverted back to how they were before. AI is a big focus for Google right now and while many people are buying these phones for those features, some are just loyal to Google and have zero reason to actually use AI features. This includes Summarize in Recorder, Pixel Screenshots, Smart Text, Live Translation, Now Playing, and a few others. You'll still have access to other Google-specific features, as those are all handled in the cloud. To begin, we're first going to launch the Settings application, and then look for the Apps menu. From here, we're going to tap on All Apps, and then look for the three-dot menu icon in the top right. We're going to tap on that, so we can select the Show System option, which will then reveal a lot more apps than we're normally given access to. So now, we're going to look for three apps in particular. You can even do a search if you want, instead of having to scroll through all of these. The first app we're going to look for is AI Core. We're going to tap on that and then tap on the Disable button and then confirm you want to disable the AI Core app. Next, you're going to look for the Android System Intelligence app. And again, you can search for it if you want, but we're going to tap on that and then tap on Disable again and then confirm that we want to disable that app. The last app we're going to look for is called Private Compute Services. So again, find that in the list, tap on it, tap on Disable, and then confirm that you want to disable that app. With all of these applications disabled, we're going to go ahead and reboot our phone. so that those changes can take full effect. When your Pixel 9 series hardware boots back up, test out a few things to see if you notice any difference. Some reports suggest that these apps hinder the performance of the smartphone, while others say they also run down the battery for features that they never use. So your phone should not only be snappier and perform better overall, but you should also gain some extra battery life as well. Now, as mentioned, if you end up missing some of these AI features that Google offers with the Pixel 9 series, you can follow the exact steps mentioned before, but this time tapping on the Enable button instead of looking for that Disable button. Then, when you reboot your phone, it will be as if you had never disabled them to begin with. I enjoy the hardware that Google has been producing lately, but many of these AI features are just not the things that I care to use. So having the ability to disable these apps definitely helps to unlock the hardware that I paid for so it can be used for apps and services that I actually use. Let me know if you have any experience disabling apps like this, as I would like to hear your feedback on how the performance and battery life has been for you after those services are no longer running in the background. And please, remember to like this video while also subscribing to the channel for more Android content like this.